pessoal, bem-vindos de volta aqui no nosso canal. Esse vídeo é curtinho, é apenas para dar um update no quadro de saúde de João Ricardo Vieira, o JV. Como vocês viram aí no vídeo anterior, ele teve uma pancada muito forte no touro nesse final de semana, na competição PBR Unleashed the Beast, lá da etapa de Indianápolis. Mas ele tá bem, a gente falou com ele ontem, ele já voltou inclusive a trabalhar lá no rancho, já tava na ativa, agradeceu o carinho, eu expliquei pra ele que a gente, a gente recebeu aqui várias mensagens, tanto no WhatsApp, quanto nos nossos grupos de rodeio, tanto no nosso inbox, querendo saber o que que aconteceu e como é que ele tá, então só pra informar pra vocês, ele tá bem, só uns hematomas ali que ficou, deixou o rosto dele meio roxo, mas fora isso ele falou que tá bem, agradece o carinho de todo mundo e por esse motivo a gente vai postar aí de novo pra vocês. Novamente, a montaria, né, na qual ele teve essas lesões e também o vídeo do JRV aí mostrando que ele tá já na ativa. Beijos e até a próxima. Let's go work. Never stop the work. Joao Ricardo Vieira, as we all just witnessed, took all the force and all the power of what Cool Whip had to offer. And thankfully, not just the bullfighters, but sports medicine is there immediately. Every single person here inside Gainbridge Fieldhouse is praying that it is not as bad as that looked. Yeah, and they're tending to him, and you can see right away he got set up. So, I mean, he's awake down there, and it looks like he's getting up. You know, it, it almost defies the laws of nature that a bull rider can get up after taking a hit like that. Mac, you lived through it. You've been through accidents like this. And again, I just want to reiterate how great our sports medicine staff is. These assessments are critical. Yeah, and we've always talked about just how tough Joao is. And, but this is... This is other level stuff, you know. He rears him back and moves forward and brings him. In. They're playing this inside the field house at the moment, like we are for everyone back home. And the groans are beyond audible. Let's send it back down to King. I was just talking to Sports Medicine. As you saw, Joel quickly set up. They told me he was speaking to them immediately. They did, of course, diagnose him with a concussion. But Joel, they said all he wanted was to get on his feet and leave the arena.